time series describing trend and variation. In this graph, this solid line is the trend line, and clearly we can see an upward linear trend. The points are scattered randomly around the line, so we see random variation. This graph shows a downward linear trend. The points are scattered randomly around the line, so we have random variation. Here we have a downward non-linear trend. The points are randomly scattered around this line, so we have random variation. This graph shows a downward linear trend. If you look at the points, there's a regular pattern like this. So these points are coming down and then there's a sudden jump upwards. And then again these points are coming down, then a sudden jump upwards. And then again the points come down, sudden jump upwards. This regular pattern that you see here shows seasonal variation. In this time series we have an upward linear trend and we have short-term variation. Short-term variation is not regular. Because the variation is not regular you couldn't say, for example, let's say you had various days during the month and the month started here and the month ends here. That wouldn't happen because if that was true, that the beginning of the month there and then the end of the month is here and you've got all of these data points in between, that would be regular. Then you could say the next month would be the same, the month after that would be the same and so on. That's not the case here. You may find that um, a month begins here and ends there, the next month starts there and ends there, the next month starts here and so on. So it's not something that's regular that you can easily predict. So this is not seasonal variation. To spot short-term variation, look for points which rise above the trend line and then they start coming down, then go below the trend line and then they start to rise again and so on. So if you can see this wave sort of pattern in your data, then you're looking at short-term variation. 